My name is Danielle, and this is Cosmo Thompson Pro. Welcome. Truly love. So I am currently at my job, but because I don't have anybody on my books, I am going to be making a pixie cut wig. So I have the model model um, dream weaver 27 piece here in the number 60 and I wanted a special color. So I got the Adores Purple Rage and I am about to watercolor it in this bucket. Yeah. Let's go. So right now I'm just the assembling the box and taking out everything. I have a closure piece to close the top off. And I have three bundles. This is the shortest bundle. This is the medium bundle. Medium bundle. And this is the long bundle. So yeah. This hair really sheds, but I really like how thin it is, so that's why I always get this one. So, yeah. Um, I'm just going to deassemble it. I'm going to head to the back and fill up this bucket with really hot water. And then I'm going to add the dye and just throw the hair in there and let it soak up. Okay, so I took all the hair out of the packaging, and I'm just going to fill the bucket with some really hot water, and I'm going to put the die in the water so yeah. okay now that i have all of the um dye in the bucket i'm just gonna take a brush and i'm gonna mix it and even though it's a small amount of hair i am gonna use most of the dye because i want it really really close so yeah i just mix it get all the lumps out then I'm just gonna start placing the bundles in the basket and yeah basically dyeing the hair all right so this is the color washed out and I am just going to take a towel now spread it out and then spread all the hair out and comb it out so it can dry properly all right child so I am home and I already have my mannequin set up with my stocking cap and I have some hard hold hairspray and I have my white glue and I have my dried hair. So this is how the color came out. I love it. So I'm going to basically start with a short bundle, work my way up, then the medium bundle, work my way up, long bundle closure you know how that just goes and then yeah we're gonna style and all the fancy stuff after i'm gonna speed her up and yeah we're gonna go from there enjoy <laughs> Okay, so the wig is fully made and I just brushed it all down and right now she is looking like like a dick. But we're gonna make her look extra nice. So I'm just gonna let the tracks like fully dry. I might just go on my blow dryer and then I'm gonna use like a razor comb, not a comb, but one of those eyebrow razors and I'm just gonna like 
razor it into shape after I try to recall it. Just to see how it fits and how it would look with the final product. So yeah. Um, let's continue. Okay, so I'm looking real crazy, but this is what the wig is looking like. <sighs> Just fresh off the mannequin. Um, it has a nice shape to it. <laughs> but we can work with it so how I usually start is I start with the ears and I'll cut those out first and then after I do the ears then I will go ahead and put it back on the mannequin and just start working around and building a shape so yeah um, I'm gonna cover back my ears and I am going to start All right, so we have some shape. It's getting very anime. I like it. So I'm gonna take some mousse and I am going to start molding the wig. Yeah. And then the part up top that I'm gonna use as my you know, fancy part. I'm just okay. gonna spike those up and allow the mousse to dry. So these are my sides. This is just gonna let you see what we're working with here. I do this then I'll see what's left we can go from there that looks pretty good so far Alright, so it's not quite dried yet with the mousse, but I'm just going to put it on anyway. So. I'm gonna style it with my iron and I think I'm gonna be done. I need to shave down the sides a little bit more. Yeah, this side probably needs to go down a little bit more. Okay, I think that looks good. This 
feel like kind of match it up more to this side a little bit. I need to take off a little bit what's over my eyes, even though I'm gonna um, iron it. This is what the back looks like on both sides. As I said, I don't think I want to take off any more. I like when it like crisses the back of my neck. So. All right, so I have ironed out the hair, and I'm going to try it on. It might be given on to you at first, but let's see. Let me secure the front part down. All right. Let's see what's going on here. Okay. So it's pretty cute. So now that it is on, I'm just going to comb everything into place. Just comb everything into place. And boom! Oh my gosh! Listen. Listen, ma'am, okay? Hair is cute, okay? It's giving vibes. I'm loving it. Now, I need some face to, you know, hype it up a little bit, but I think overall it looks really cute. Um, yeah.